Alright. This is called a box. Alright, so this is my first unboxing video. I'm very excited. I just ordered a tripod for the first time ever. This is my first tripod. And this is a pretty big box because apparently it's a pretty big tripod. And I'm really excited because I'm gonna shoot my first music video thingy this month. That's what I'm planning on. And I need a tripod for it because I'm gonna be doing it outside. And I'm using a box cutter. I used to work at Giant uh, for like four and a half years. Uh, grocery store, if you're not familiar. And I just quit last year. And we used to use these all the time. A lot of box cutting going on at Giant. It was so fun. I just loved it so much. I was really passionate about it, which is why I quit. So I'm really good at it. So that's a good thing that came out of it. Good at cutting boxes. Uh, this is actually really small compared to the box. That's kind of deceiving. Well, it's still cool though. It's called Faux Pick, uh, you know, Advanced Photography Specialty. Yeah. Faux Pick 77 inches tripod LI something. Okay, so, but that's a tripod, so that's cool. So I'm gonna put this box over here. Apparently this is a really good tripod. Uh, it was recommended to me by a fellow YouTuber. And she uses this a lot apparently. And she was saying that a lot of professionals use this. So it's like a really good quality tripod. And it's actually affordable. This is like $70, something like that. Over, so it's under $100. So I was like, oh, all right, cool. Sounds good. And apparently it's good for outside too, which is what I need. <laughs> it's a cool little carrying case. I feel funny. All right, yeah, a little carrying case. I guess that's cute. Would you describe that as cute? I think that a lot of small things are cute for some reason. That's what it seems like. People think small things are cute, just in general. It's something that I realized. I don't know why. Actually, I do know why, but I'm not gonna go into that. All right, my first tripod. Cool, looks cool. I like the orange, yeah. Matches my walls. You can't really see my walls, but they're orange. They're like that shade of orange, that's kind of cool. Oh, we gotta, okay, do that, take the thing out. Take the leg thing out, there's these little clampies. Clampy clamps. You got this little bag. And this is definitely not a review, as you can probably tell, because I don't know anything about tripods. But it is a box opening session thing. All right, good little pouch. You can put stuff in there. <laughs> you got, um, you know, a lot of cool stuff. Oh, that's cool. I like I like the sound it makes. It gets an A on the sound. Alright, it's cool. Well, I'm excited. I mean, I'm, I'm assuming it's pretty straightforward <laughs> to use. I'm just, you know, kind of exploring this new contraption that I'm not familiar with. Not familiar with this thing. So this is cool. Got these, the, you know, grippy grips. I'm pretty sure that's what they're called. And I like it. I like the grippy grip. And I like all these <laughs> little knobs and everything. I was about to get my camera, but I'm using it, so I can't really display the camera. Um, but, yeah. <laughs> it says, release detachable monopod. So, if you know what that means, then, you know, you can understand that better than I do. Oh. I guess this is a monopod. So, you turn it left. Release left. And then, well, okay. So, it's detachable. In case you want it to be detached. Screw back in if you want it back in. All right. Oh, cool. So, oh, the clampy clamps are for when you want to unclamp the clamps and then you pull it out and then it's longer. That's actually cool. I actually understand something now. Cool. Oh, extra clamps. Oh my God, that's really long. <laughs> longer the better, you know what I mean? So you can get like a really high angle, I guess, or whatever. So that's pretty cool. Or if you're up high, 
and then you put the tripod on the ground below you and it'll get you just right. But this is cool, I like this. I can see this coming in handy in the future in different circumstances. I don't know. Oh, you can make the top longer too? This is cool. All right, so I just put back down. And then screwy, screwer. All right. All right, I'm gonna set it up so I'm not like carrying it constantly for the video. So let's undo the clampers and unclamp the clamps and then we're gonna put it on the ground. I'm gonna do the extra clamp. I'm gonna do it. So extra clamp, extra long, and then it goes down to the ground and then that thing. So we got three unclamped clamps. clamps. Oh, oh, so when you when you extend it and then then you clamp it up again. I just got that. All right. So then you clamp it up, and then you can put it on the ground. All right. So that's like that's standing up there, isn't it? That's standing. Got some instructions here. Instruction manual comes with one of those um you know wrench thingies. The uh, Allen wrench, I think that's what it's called, or uh, an Allen key, as some people call it. All right. Cool. So instruction manual. I'm actually really excited about this. this is awesome. I actually love how this looks. All, all joking aside, I actually really do really like this. And I like how easy it was to set up. Now I feel like I'm reviewing it, which I guess I am in a way. I do like how easy it was to set up. Like I didn't even need to look at the freaking directions, which is kind of, I guess, the thing that a lot of dudes do. It's just like, I don't need directions. But anyway, I didn't need directions apparently. I mean, maybe there's some stuff that I, I didn't figure out yet. I'll look in here probably, maybe not. This is just really cool. I really did like how easy it was to set up and to figure everything out. It just took like five minutes or something and really simple. And this is awesome. I like how adjustable actually the legs are. It's very adjustable. I like that a lot. I like the colors, even though that's not, you know, it's just an aesthetic thing, but I like the colors, black and orange. It's kind of cool looking. I'm really excited to shoot my first music video with this. This is gonna be really, really cool. So that fellow YouTuber I was talking about, her name's Caitlin Finley, and she's actually a cellist, and she plays really awesome uh, video game covers on her channel, uh, Caitlin Finley, and also on her Twitch and all that stuff. I actually got this from her affiliate link. She has an affiliate link with these things, and uh, I'm gonna put the link in the description so you can get it from her too. And it's just really a win-win because you get what you want and it also helps her out. So just why not do that? I mean, that's what I did. So it's going to take you to her affiliate page thing where it shows all of her gear and you can just click on this one. And like I said, it's like $70 or something like that. So it's under 100 and it helps her out too. So just why not just do that? So it's going to be in the description. I'm actually going to smell it. I feel the need to smell things when I get them, like new things like this. It doesn't really smell like much, but this thing, this kind of smells. I kind of like the way that this thing smells. I don't know, sometimes things smell good, like new books and stuff. That's one of my favorite smells ever. I love that smell. And just like plastic and stuff, it's probably not the best thing ever, but I like it. Anyway, yeah. uh, the, um, the handheld thing, that smells pretty good too. Just so you know, in case you were wondering. This is, it looks good. And it smells really good. No, but seriously, this is awesome. I'm really, really excited about this. I'm really grateful that you told me about this. And also my sister is a photographer and she helped me out with figuring out if this is gonna work with my camera, which is what she helped me get the camera. So it's like my sister is also freaking amazing. Anyway, that's just awesome. There's like really, really great people. They're, they're both freaking great. I usually post guitar performances as well as guitar related tips and recording tips and stuff like that. Uh, this is, like I said, this is the first unboxing video I did. Uh, I guess if you want to see more of that, um, you can request it, but I'll know in the next time I'm going to buy something like this, so I don't know how long that's going to be. So I hope you like that. Um, I post new stuff on Mondays and Thursdays, and also I have a Patreon that you can go to. I'm going to put the link in the description. Very grateful for my Patreon community. Very, very grateful for you guys. You're awesome. Yeah, so really cool exclusive stuff that I only offer on there, such as outtakes from my videos that are too embarrassing to put on YouTube. I actually thought about, hey, should I put some of these on YouTube to like promote it or whatever? But I was like, no, nah, I think I'm going to keep it on Patreon because they're just too embarrassing. But they're also really funny. And I crack up 
laughing every time I watch it because it's just funny. So definitely go there if you're interested in that. It also really helps me out a lot. Really, really appreciative. Thanks so much, and uh, I'll see you in the next video. All right, see ya.